All right, guys, what is up? Today, today, a little bit of a new fun day gun day. I got a new, I got a new rifle the other day. Uh, it's a, uh, I got it from a friend of mine. He uh, just wanted to sell it, needed some money. Hey, I bought, a, I bought a rifle, right? I've never owned a 22 Magnum rifle. Of all the rifles I've ever owned, I've never owned a 22 Magnum. This particular one that I've purchased has been done over and over and over again on YouTube. I found this out after I purchased this firearm. There's a million videos on this gun. But uh, up until I purchased this one, uh, this was the only 22 Magnum I had. My little Heritage Rough Rider. That is the only 22 Magnum that I have. So, uh, I mean, I've been around 22 Magnum a lot. I've shot it a lot, but, uh, but I've never owned a 22 Magnum rifle. I've got a 17 HMR and countless 22s, but I've never owned 22 Magnum. My brother always owned one. My cousins always owned one. I mean, everybody always had one. I just never did. Never, never did. Uh, they're a great round. They're a great, they're great for, uh, you know, pests around the farm. Uh, uh, coyote hunting, maybe. You know they're 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 great a great farm gun. They are a great round for a farm gun. That's that's just all there is to it. So uh, this is the uh, heritage that I have in 22 Magnum. Now, like I said just the other day, uh, this will be what we're shooting today. Some 30 grain V Max. That's what we'll be shooting today. Uh, I know it's a little windy. We had some thunderstorms roll through here this morning, so hopefully it's not too bad. But uh. This is it. This is it. It's a Ruger American bolt action. It's got a six hour whiskey three, three by nine by 40. It's a, it's a great firearm. It really is. I've shot it quite a bit since I've got it. So, uh, so I already know what it'll do. I just purchased the 15 round magazine for it yesterday. So I was, I was down here at my range trying it out just now. Uh, I figured I'd make a video, and uh, we'll see about making a five-shot group on one of them targets down there. I'll I'll uh, I'll take the camera down there, and uh, you guys will get to see get to see my group. Now, I I am shooting off of uh, some Caldwell shooting bags. That's that's all I ever shoot off of. I'm what I like to call deer hunter accurate. All right, I am not a precision shooter. I, I'm I'm deer season accurate. That's that's what I'm gonna go with. Deer season accurate. But anyway, this is a great firearm. Great firearm. I've I really I really like it. Nice short 18 inch barrel. It's got a modular stock system. Uh, I didn't get any of that with it. But it come, if you buy one of these brand new, it comes with a one with a longer pull or a shorter pull, I think, and maybe the cone's different. I, I'm not sure because this gun didn't you know didn't come with it. But it'll come with one of these factory factory nine round magazines so therefore you have uh you have 10 rounds you know nine in the magazine one in the pipe you got 10 rounds unless you buy one of these 15 rounders and then you have 16 rounds right as long as you got one in the pipe but uh i've got a sling ordered for it it's one of those uh paracord slings off of amazon it's made out of paracord uh i've actually have two of those paracord slings there <laughs> They're actually very nice. I really like them. They're dirt cheap, like $9.99. But the one I'm getting is uh, green green paracord in the middle. And then out on the edges of the paracord, it's got black we, uh, you know, woven in with it. So it'll, it'll match up really good with this gun, too. But, uh, all right, that's enough of me talking. I'll, uh, I'll get set up here. I'll get the camera set up. I'll get the camera set up downrange. And uh, we'll do a five-shot group. Then we'll come back talk about it. And uh, just remember, don't be too hard on me because I'm shooting off bags. And like I said, I'm deer hunter accurate, man. That's uh, that, that's that's just the way it is. All right, buddy. Well, we'll uh, all right, guys. We'll be back. Give me a second here. Get everything set up.
all right guys that's it that is my uh that's my group you can see size my thumb here a little bigger than my thumb you know i figured 50 yards you know that's pretty good you know it's uh it's definitely chew can will definitely cover it you know as long as your chew can will cover your holes i think you're in pretty good shape you know all right it's about what we got all right we'll go back and uh we'll go back and talk about it a little bit more here but uh i think it's pretty good pretty accurate i uh i like it i know this uh this this gun's been videoed and videoed over and over i i had no idea that there was that many videos on this uh firearm but anyway we'll get back over here and get set back up and uh We'll see what we got going on now. All right, guys. I did notice one thing. Whenever I would go to bolt around into this, with this magazine, for some reason, you have to make sure that you rack that bolt all the way back. I was actually short chucking it, believe it or not, and it wasn't quite getting getting all of the all the casing. So you have to. You have to make sure that you make sure you slam it all the way back, all the way forward. I mean, I mean that's self-explanatory, but still, it was it was kind of odd that that it was missing the rim of the of the bullet a little bit. So I don't know, maybe the magazine needs wore in more. I don't know. It was just a little a little wonky. But anyway, guys, that's all I got. The, uh, it was hitting just a little bit high, so I just adjusted the scope back down just a little bit. I'm going to shoot it again here in a minute, but uh, anyway, that's all I got, guys. I just wanted to show you guys my new 22 Magnum that I got for a uh, farm gun. All right, we'll see you guys. See ya.